they were coaching us. But I, I can tell you for free, bro. Yeah, yeah, with this coach, bro. He teaches you not not only on the on the pitch. He teaches you how to live your life, bro. Okay. Just 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 imagine, bro. On this level, the coach he visits every player of the team's apartment. Yeah. To check if your apartment is properly clean, bro. So if he comes and see your apartment is not clean, bro, he takes you to the stadium the next day. You gonna run? Oh, bro. He's so he, he's, he's more like a father. Bro, you see, you see, yeah, now, bro, I have this, I have this. I need to call it today before tomorrow. If I don't call this, bro, I will have to do like four hundred push up. Bro, it's punishment. He wants you, like he teach you everything what to do, bro. Yeah, you don't. If you do tattoo, bro, it's a problem. Wow. You put you put earring in your ear and he sees it, bro. It's a problem for you. But yeah, you. you... You are a professional player. Let's look at that. It's true, but you, this is philosophy, bro. That's the reason he don't take players over 25 years. Okay. He wants only young players that he can teach. Okay. He can tell you how to live your life until your football is finished. When you are done with it, it's, you are free to do whatever. Okay. You are free to do whatever. But yeah, bro, it's, it's really, 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 really tough. He's, he's not only teaching you football. He's teaching you life. How to do this? How to do that? Like now, you see, he don't want you feel complacent. Like, okay, I'm a professional player, bro. I go now. I go and do tattoo. I put my earring. I have this. I do this, bro. Oh, he doesn't, yeah, he, 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 you know, you know, you know, you know what he asks you. You know what he asks you. He ask you like, is your family? Are you from a millionaire family? No. <laughs> he said. He said <laughs> that's the first question he asked you, bro. Are you from a millionaire oh, family? Yes, to, to, for real, it's surprising to see a coach treating a professional player like that. Bro, that's how it is. He asks you, are you from your family? No. Your family doesn't ask you for money. Everything is okay back home. No. They ask me for money. Okay. Now they need money for you. Do you think you, you can make this money like this? How? Okay, now you are here. You start to, to, to feel like you are a professional player already. You have money. You have reached the, the top level you want to reach. He said, this level is not your level. Oh. Bro, that's why he says every time, especially to me, bro. Like, this level is not your level. You need to go higher. You need to do this. You need to do that, bro. So every time there is a lot of pressure on how you live your life. You go to training, bro. He sees you. He wants to see you. Okay, like, is this your hair? You see, now I have a problem with my hair right now. I had to do a lot of running today for my hair because I haven't cut my hair. I'm afraid, like, I don't want to go to barbing shop right now. He told me, I'm not speaking anymore. You have to run. I ran. And tomorrow, if I go like this, I have to run again. He wants you, like, you are in school. He said, this is a school. It's not for... You know, our team, our team, the, 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 the nickname of our team is student. Okay. Yeah, because okay. It's, a, it's a university. Okay. Uh-huh. You understand? Okay, our other... I see. I see. I we see. are the students. That's the problem. I see. Uh-huh. That's it. So he wants you as like, you want you act like you are one of them. You are cool. You don't have this. That's if you have a player above this level, you don't stay much time in the team because he feels like you know everything. If he tries to tell you run, and you say no, I can't run like two times. It's okay, no problem. Goodbye. That's how it is. So it's 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 like he's teaching you everything, brand new. Everything like so. I was confused when I came at first. But why why are we caught? You know I have dreadlocks. Yeah, I know. I'm and you even see you even see Edward. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's yeah. how it is, bro. I so was, I was wondering, I was wondering what's going on. That's how it is, bro. When you come here with your dreadlock, the first time when I came, the agent told me cut your dreadlock. I said, why would I call my dreadlock? I'm going to sign a professional contract. What do I need to call my dreadlock? He said, okay, no problem. I went to the change room. The first day I saw everybody, bro. No more, no beer. No, hair low, everything, no more. So I was like, what going on? Yeah, what really going on? And then he saw me. <laughs> I have I have my 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 cap, my hat on my hair like this. And then he told me take off the hat because when he speaks, every time before training, he speaks like one hour. Tell what we're going to do on the page, how we need to do this, how to, and speak a lot. So he told me to take off the when I took off the hat, he saw my dreadlocks. <laughs> he laughed. See tomorrow. God. So I was like, why would he say it? 
And then I had two, three players, like they call me and say, come, come and see. They show me their, their photos. Yeah. The white guy, see here, bro, long. He said, we caught because of him. So you need to cut your hair. I had to cut my hair, bro. That's the problem. So he's teaching. He's not only coaching. So, so basically, basically, he's, he's making... He, even though you are playing in a professional league, a professional club, he makes you understand you are nowhere where you're supposed to be. Nowhere. You haven't done anything yet. Wow. That's I it. Haven't heard, I haven't heard of a coach like that. Seriously. That's how he is, bro. Seriously. You, he tells you you haven't done anything yet. If you play football today, you feel like you have played better. He'll call you. He said you haven't played... 50% of your 100%, 50% of your best you haven't played yet. Because he always wants you to have that, 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 that lion heart and want to push harder, 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 harder. That's how it is, bro. So even if you play good some days, if he calls you like, you shouldn't play anything. And you start to worry, bro. You start to you start worry. You start to worry. And the next game. And you want to do game, more. You want to give. You want to that's, give that's, 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 that's him. I think I think it's working for him because his team is his team is is winning now and one of the top teams in the league. Mm -hmm. It's it's working for him. It's working. So, been... so, so basically, he's having a very young team. Very young team. Very young team. Very young and very young and inexperienced players. Players oh. from I said very young, bro. <laughs> Last year it was worse because everybody was their first time playing in the highest league. Everybody. Now, at least people they are playing like 20 games, 21 games in the highest league. So now everybody understands the football. But no player like play the higher level before and come to this team, no. Oh. No, no, no. So that's what shocked people, bro. How would this team that don't have like four to five experienced players on this level? How they play on this level? Basically, 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 coaches, coaches one, two, three. Experienced player to push that team. So he doesn't care. We have only one guy. He's the goalkeeper. He's old. He played in... But he's a goalkeeper, bro. He's like 36 years now. 